All right, guys, I just wanted to hop on really quick and tell you that once I'm going back watching my video before I edit some of it and post it, um, I want to apologize because my TV was super, super loud. So I'm so sorry about that. I was like, oh my God, I didn't think it was that loud. And I lowered the thing before I started my video. So just wanted to apologize for that. Now let's continue the video because there's a giveaway at the end. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you um, stuff that I got for my 16 year old son. Like I said, it's, I, it's supposed to be stocking gifts, but you already know <laughs> that I don't make a stocking gift. I pretty much make a stocking bag because... I go overboard. I collect stuff throughout the year. And then when Dollar Tree brings all these amazing name item stuff, then I just keep gathering stuff and adding some more. I just can't help myself. It's a dollar. And why wouldn't you want to give your kid a little bit more when you're spending a dollar for each item? Anyways, but I want to say congratulations to all the winners yesterday, um, to all my new subbies. I want to thank you guys, my oldies and goodies. You already know what I'm going to say. You guys are the real MVP and I love you all um for all the ones that message me for everyone everyone who has sent a little prayer for my daughter my granddaughter and even for myself telling me to you know hoping that i feel better because i've been having massive migraines today i feel pretty good i got up early i was you know able to get dinner out of the way and yeah so i was like just lounging watching a few christmas movies and I said, you know what, let me get this video together because today I have to start the second part of my 12 day giveaway. So I think I'm gonna do it a little bit different. I think every time I post a giveaway, I'm gonna, the following day, I think I'm gonna pick a winner only because I get messages sometimes like, oh, you know, I didn't see my name or something. I have no control over that. Um, we do the random YouTube picker thing it picks the name we have no control over that there's no way i can fix that there's no way i can do anything so yeah i'm thinking that that's what i might do i'm not sure you guys don't know because i'll post a video and i'll say check if you're the winner and if not then i'll just wait like i did before which is easier and i go to each and every video that i posted a giveaway and i pick a random winner out of there all right so first things first i'm gonna show you the bag that I have for my son, which is this one, morning, no, coming to town. And then it has Santa, and I picked this bag because this little guy here looks like my doggy Charlie, and my dog, I mean my dog. <laughs> yeah, Nathan's my little dog too. No, I'm just, um, Nathan really has a lot of love for Charlie, so I thought that was really cute. So that's the reason why I picked that bag. So I have some things on the floor that I have not put in there yet only because I'm afraid I'm gonna wait towards the end because I don't want it to spill even though these are sealed I just have a problem with thinking that I don't know you push something you crush something or it punctures somehow so anyway so you guys already know that Dollar Tree finally Bolero finally came out with men's um, men's body wash shampoo and stuff like that so this one's cedarwood and eucalyptus. I don't really know how it smells, but I love eucalyptus and cedarwood, so I'm assuming it's going to smell good. This is 13.5 ounces, and I picked this up because my son really likes to use body wash when he showers. I don't know if this is the greatest shampoo for my son's type of hair. Oh, this one's a little open. Oh, but I think that was me before when I first bought it. And it's okay, it's going to my son, so if it was going to someone else, I wouldn't give it to them. I don't know, it smells... I could kind of smell the cedarwood, the eucalyptus, I'm picking up very faint, like... But it's overall, it smells really, really good. It's a soft smell, you know, my son doesn't like nothing very strong, so I thought this was good for him. This is the shampoo and conditioner 13.5. Again, my son has really, like dry um i don't want to use the word nappy because i don't want to sound like 
he's my baby so whatever i love his hair i wish i had his hair but yeah it's like that really nice fro type hair and um certain things are not good for his hair is what i want to say you know so i don't know we're gonna give it a whirl and see um he doesn't use a lot of things in his hair he really doesn't he doesn't like any type of chemical in his hair but i still picked this up just to see because since quarantine and we've been home and we haven't done anything he hasn't done much with his hair besides shaved it all off and then regretting shaving his hair so he says that once he can start fixing his growing his hair it's i mean to me it's grown a lot but to him it's not long enough so he says that once he starts doing once his hair gets longer he wants to start like um doing things to it a little bit so i figure okay you know i'll pick this up garnier fruct fructis fructis i can't speak style matte and messy you guys already know about this i picked one up just to put in his stocking to see if he wants to give it a whirl but i buy him expensive stuff for his hair again because only the type of hair he has he has it's really dry so we need to give it extra love and so stuff like this but i figure if you put just a little dab in your hands with a little bit of water whatever and just you know i don't think it should be that bad carmex because he's always asking me for a chapstick and Dollar Tree carries Carmex, and why not? So I'm gonna throw this in his stocking. And while I was in Chicago, I picked some of these up because we don't have any more, and um, we don't have any more stuff for winter. So when we go out there, we're like stuck buying at the last minute, and I just figured this would be nice for him to have. So if we ever do get the chance to go back home and visit, he has something nice and warm for his ears if we go in the winter. They don't sell this kind of stuff a lot here in Florida. But if you're in a cold state, you might find these. And this one is women, but my son is 16, skinny, small. Once you take the tag off, no one's going to know this is women. So it'll work for what he needs. I also picked this up um the tag came off because i had it in a drawer and i got stuck but i picked this up in chicago as well again because my son i was trying to give you guys like a little winter look because i was <laughs> i was doing a christmas video but um uh, this is the slouchy binny and my son really likes these so i thought you know i saw it in chicago and i thought it was nice to put in his stocking again so when we go back home and visit he can wear these because you know he likes that slouchy little look in the back so if we ever go for the cold then my son can have that let me put this here because i don't want it to okay he really he, my son's a big fan of bob ross again this is stuff that you know your son better than anybody you're 16 year i'm sorry if you can hear the tv i have christmas movie playing since earlier today um you know yours your child better than anybody you know what they like and i picked up stuff that nathan would appreciate and would like doing with either as a family or on his own or stuff that he likes he's a big bob ross fan so i thought this was nice to pick up and do as a family or like me and him spend some quality time together so i picked up the 300 puzzle and i really love how it looks the background and all that stuff is really pretty so yes, I picked this up at Dollar Tree too. I'm showing you Dollar Tree stuff first. Then I picked these up. Again, my son has the, um, I don't want to say it wrong. I said it wrong the last video that I talked about him. AirPods, I'm hoping I said, <laughs> I said it right. But sometimes, sometimes they can't find them or something's wrong with one other side of the, Air, the headphones and they're always asking me like they're just assume I'm mom and I have extra stuff piled everywhere and sometimes I do but <laughs> that's not the case the case is that you know they're always asking me stuff so I like to buy these things extra whether he keeps it in his room or gives it to me to put away I'm just you know they're not the best but when you need something last minute and you want to listen to music or TV show or something you want to do and you don't have headphones or somebody might come over one of his friends that don't have headphones so i just picked these up i like that they were gray the other day i saw 
that they had it um they had them in black i wish i would have but you know gray is a nice color too so i picked this one up and i picked these up as well for backup because you just never know and i thought these were really nice and easier to just be able to use so because the first time i went to buy something like that they didn't have them that's why i picked up the other ones but then i went i go to dollar tree all the time so go figure they were sitting there in different colors i don't white like blue purple any you know pink so i figured they were nice to grab for my son um i figured when he ever goes back out there to the real world he might want to smell good he's gonna be 17 years old so you know ladies ladies out there so i picked this is new to me i never um seen anything like this at dollar tree i've seen like the ones for for women but this is compared to cool water so and it smells really really nice i smelled it on camera so you guys can see and it has the little body wash again my son enjoys body wash so i thought this was nice for a dollar to put in his stocking and again guys you know your kids you know if they're gonna be like i'm not wearing that but my son really it doesn't bother him so, you know it's nice stuff and he'll just like put a little bit and why not and he's always asking for deodorant so i always put deodorant in his stocking yes i do i'm that kind of mom so i bought i bought the all day dry speed stick this one's really good he doesn't like the gel one so i always got to make sure that but it smells really good manly sporty you know so i picked this one up for him and it's not too bad 1.8 ounce what else did we get from dollar tree um like i mentioned before um my son has like little issues of like um depression anxiety stuff like that's been going on for quite some time and so i try to give him stuff that keep his mind off of things you know that will distract him for a little bit um my husband and i went to the escape room a year ago i want to say and he really enjoyed that so i came across this at the dollar tree and i know he loves to challenge my husband play games and stuff like that and so i thought this was good for both of them to enjoy and try so i got him that and then i found this one the desktop um darts i thought he would like this and have it on his desk and i don't know try it out so again these are just little things that i think that nathan might, might enjoy and if not then it was just a dollar it's no big deal but i think he will so and then i picked up um i always pick iphone chargers and android chargers because again they break they they bend they're no good they're always asking me for extra so i like to put them in their stockings I just need to go pick up the iPhone charger one, but usually I pick up the Android at five below, or if I'm at Dollar Tree, I pick one up there. Just for backup, this is the micro USB cable and it lights up and it's blue. So I picked that up for Nathan. For his stocking, these are stocking things, guys. And I picked up um, this little Assure for Men dual sided sponge i thought this was nice since he showers with body wash and then it's black i thought it was perfect for him and what else do i have that is from dollar tree now what i have is a lot of snacks that i usually put the candies in the stocking so i'm gonna i'm gonna see what i put in, in his stocking so it doesn't look empty but yeah, I usually put the sweets. My phone's always dying when I'm recording. So I always put the sweets in stockings. So you guys saw me haul this. And I just thought it was fun to put one in my son's um, stocking bag. So to see if he likes it. I'm just trying to make sure that all the Dollar Tree stuff is done. All right. So now for, for candy. I found this huge bag of Black Forest Juicy Bears. I'm going to throw this in his stocking. I found this at Dollar Tree, this big bag. 
And then I got him some Sweet Tarts, Twisted Rainbow Punch Soft and Chewy Ropes. I thought maybe he wanted to give this a try. See, I'm sure he'll like it. And then he really likes the Minis Unwrapped White Little Kit Kat Bags. So I'm going to throw that in there. And then I'm going to throw in, he. this is his favorite, the Kinder Bueno Crispy Creamy Chocolate Bar. It has two in there. So my son really likes that. And of course he loves hot chips, so I'm going to throw a bag or two of hot chips in there as well. And then I picked up the most stuffed Oreo because he really likes these as well. So I picked up the one pack of four. All right, guys. So that's from Dollar Tree for my son. For my kiddo. Now let me show you guys what I picked up that is not Dollar Tree. So I picked up, he's a big fan of Jack. And Sally and I found these at Walmart. Thought these were really fun long because you know kids nowadays love fun long socks. And these are six pair of the Nightmare Before Christmas casual crew socks. So I picked that up at Walmart. I think this was like $8.98 or $8.88, something like that. Then I picked up some he has a situation with his legs, so he's not really allowed to wear ankle socks anymore. So I kind of want to get rid of all the ankle socks so he stops wearing them. Um, so I got him a pack of the um, men's. These are not actual. I don't know that they're considered like the quarter crew socks. I don't know. But they're a lot longer on the top. The ones that he has are like up to here. So just so he doesn't feel like I'm taking away the socks completely that he likes to wear. I bought him this three pair set of Adidas and Marshalls. These were $5.99. And like I said, he's a big fan of Jack. His whole room has, you know, before it had the sheets, the pillows and all that. He's outgrown that a little bit. So now he just has solid colors on his bed. But yes, he still has on his shelves like little knickknacks and like he has picture frames um stuff like that so i found i found him at five below sitting there lonely for five dollars and i thought he was super cute for nathan to just have i don't know hanging by his um headphone stand or something next to him next to it or something i don't know i'm sure he'll find something to do with that but i'm sure he'll enjoy him as well and then I told you guys, my son, I don't know if you're watching my videos. I doubt it. He has an obsession with Billy. So I bought him this shirt of Billy Eilish. It was 50% off for Cyber Monday. So let's say I pay $11.50 for it. There goes Charlie. So I picked up a size medium. The small look too small and a medium look a little big, but I figured if they shrinks. I'm okay. Um, and the last thing that I bought for my son's stocking, I buy scratch off tickets. I don't know if everybody does the same, but I figure for a dollar, you let's say you win 50 bucks, 25 bucks, 100 bucks, your gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> Even if you get a free ticket and you go get a ticket and you want something else so yeah i bought two of those actually my husband picked them up today so that is it as far as nathan's stockings we're just gonna put like the hot chips in there um oh no 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 guys i did forget give me one second one second guys hey, i was doing that i'm so sorry i knew i was forgetting something let me lower the tv roll about it okay guys i'm back so and this is the last thing that will go to his gift and i'm pretty much done with nathan thank god so yes that is the last thing now for the give giveaway giveaway 
for the giveaway. This is the next item for the seventh day of Christmas that is up for grab. And you also get a coupon. So if you like something, you have $15 off of whatever perfume bottle you like in there. So this is the next one for grab. Um, again, you have to be subscribed, like, comment if you mind. If you don't mind sharing, it will really help my videos. And my channel will really help my channel, not my videos. Or would it? Whatever, my channel. So, live in the U.S. Um, and remember, guys, when you win, you have 24 hours. I have one winner that has not yet. And I feel so bad because I really want to give these items out to you, but I feel bad. You have 24 hours to get back to me for me to be able to, because I don't want to leave the other winners waiting on their present. So, I like to mail everything all at once. So yes, this is the next one for grab on the seventh day of Christmas. I will start my sixth day again. Some people comment and make me feel like I'm cheating or I'm doing something. And I really have no control. If you see your name or you didn't see your name, I apologize if that's how you feel. Or maybe you don't feel like that and you just wanted to let me know. So if that's the case, I apologize if I'm saying something wrong. But I'm thinking that I might do might pick tomorrow's winner for this or you know make my life easier and just pick a winner from each video at one time because it's just easier that way but we shall see so that is it guys for this video i just wanted to thank you all for being so kind and loving and reaching out to me praying for my daughter praying for me um sending me well wishes um being kind sharing commenting i love to hear from you guys i love to talk to you guys and um yeah and to all my new subbies welcome welcome and thank you for considering and subscribing it means that you enjoy something you came across my channel or whatever you like what i do and i really appreciate you um staying and hanging out with me so with that being said guys i'm gonna let you guys go and I'll see you guys tomorrow. This is part of my blocked mods, black mods, seven today because I really didn't do much. And so I just wanted to share some stuff with you guys. But I wish you all a great night. Be kind to one another. Be kind to one another, please. And I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye.